Hello and welcome to Krishi Jagran Business. This video is powered by Still. I am Shruti Savarya and in today's video, let's look at the major news update. Adani Green Energy Limited has committed to building the world's greatest renewable energy park in Khabra, Gujarat's Kutch district. This initiative, which has a vast area of 538 square kilometers, is five times the size of Paris. It is expected to reach the capacity of 30 gigawatts with a financial investment of rupees 1.5 lakh crore from the Adani Group. Solar panels have been deployed to harness sunlight and convert it into electricity, while wind turbines have been erected in the park to capture wind speeds of up to 8 meters per second. Moreover, part of the project entails setting up residential areas for workers and implementing desalination facilities to treat saline groundwater sourced from the depth of 700 meters, making it portable. The choice of Khabra as the location of the park was designed for various reasons. First, the region accounts for more than one lakh hectares of barren land, offering the ideal site for renewable energy infrastructure, coupled with its climate conditions that support solar and wind energy generation resources. However, the area is very close to the border with India's neighbor Pakistan, which meant that the park required clearance from the Defence Ministry to prevent security threats. Despite its promising potential, the construction of the hybrid renewable energy park has considerable hurdles. The environmental conditions of the runoff gorge, which includes the area's humid air, saline water and soil presented several logistic challenges in addition the security endeavors affiliated with the pakistan border have necessitated implementation with fears of infiltration of the area by hostile elements in the khawra region where solar radiations measure an impressive 2060 kilowatt per meter square and wind resources rank among india's finest the frequent occurrence of sandstorms poses a challenge necessitating the regular cleaning of the solar panels often multiple times within a day in response to this challenge project executives have disclosed plans to introduce waterless robotic module cleaning systems across the entire project site that's all for today this is shruti samvarya stay tuned to krishi jagran business for more updates